My name is Emma, also known as Emma the Alchemist, and I am the creator and founder of Movement is Medicine. Movement is Medicine is a technique and a teaching I've created using dance, somatic meditation and music to get people out of their heads and into their physical bodies. Um, it's a really simple technique. Um, the meditation that we use um, uses the body as its main focus point. Um, and then using dance, it's all about free flow. So you don't have to be a dancer to do it. It's all about just coming into your own movement, your natural state of movement, which takes it back into our ability to be primal um, and allow our bodies to take over and lead because that's how we uh, essentially able to access the release that we need from stress and trauma. It's also become um, not just a teaching and a technique, but part of people's lifestyles because it is so simple. So once they understand the simplicity of it, they just incorporate it into their lifestyles and do it on a daily basis. And it doesn't have to like take up a huge chunk of their day or their time. It's just something that they don't need any equipment for. They can just do it in their own homes. And all you need is a playlist. And therefore, that's how powerful this teaching and technique is. It actually has changed people's way of life and their culture. Accessibility is super important to me. It has to be as inclusive as possible because people are going through all sorts of different stuff. So when things are quite exclusive, either due to cost or due to the abilities that you need or the equipment that you need, etc., these things all have an impact on making things exclusive. And I don't believe in exclusivity in regards to when it comes to healing or even just like trying to find your joy. These are the things that we should just be doing in our day-to-day -day lives. So making this work as accessible as possible is my number one aim with it. So I connected to dance as a healing modality after my own serious health journey. When I was in recovery, I could not exercise at all. I had no strength and I also had loads of problems with my legs when I was ill. Um, so I couldn't walk in stages and the damage that was left made me quite um, immobile. So I was in my house and I just decided to start dancing because I was just a raver. I was just somebody that used to go out dancing week in, week out. I had a very long extensive career in the music industry and I started to remind myself after this like huge traumatic incident that happened to me why I love music and dance so much. And I found it very healing just being able to go into raves, go into these spaces which are all about connection to the music and obviously the people around you. And so I just started to essentially recreate that in my own house. And I started to find that I was loosening things up and I was able to let go of like stress and emotions and all these things that were building up in my system that were creating a block between me getting to a certain point physically. And so I just started to incorporate it as a daily practice, made a promise to myself for 365 days I would dance to at least one song a day and I did it and it really helped me in that period of time. So I created the Movement is Medicine Challenge where I just like made a playlist of like really upbeat songs all from like sort of house music rounds um, and inspired people to just dance every day to one song and just to track how it made them feel um, and that's sort of where this concept was all really born from. So the main benefits that people are seeing from this practice are they're able to come and find relief in their physical body from tension, stress, pain, etc. Um, that's one of the main benefits is that the shift in the physical body. And because they found that shift in the physical body, it also has impacted their mind. So that is the mind-body connection that we're looking for and it's all to do with the nervous system. So the class is different to anything else because I've created a teaching essentially based around this meditation that is using different techniques to get people physically into their body, create body awareness. So by the time we stand up and we start to dance and we start to move all of this stuff that we've got going on in our system, we are already in a really, really embodied place. And therefore, because we're in an embodied place, we understand the shift in how our body and our energy feels. So there is nothing else like it out there. There is no teaching that incorporates all of these different aspects that I've pulled in together. So the music that I play is super specific. It's all based around anything that has a drum to it or anything that has got some sort of level of soul to it because the drum is our um, universal instrument across all cultures around the world and it has been since you know, time began, humans existed, it's always been there. So when we hear the drum, it activates something different inside of us. However, we as Westerners have been looking for things like rave culture. So that's what I grew up, I grew up on the rave scene. And so we've got 
genres like Tribal House and Afro House and Drum and Bass and UK Garage and UK Funky House and all these things that incorporate all of these genres that are all about the drum and so I essentially play music that people are going to also connect to. The benefits really are across the board. There is no like, oh it just does this. It's depending on who you are and what you're looking for. As long as you're somebody that's open to coming and trying something new that's going to impact and hopefully benefit both your mind and your body, then you will find what you're looking for. You really will. Anyone can join. As I said, it's literally for everyone and I'm trying to take this to the masses so that people really start to understand how easy and simple this is and change the culture we have around you know, healing and lifestyle and just emerging them into one thing.